Hey. Dawson, I need your help with something. Yeah, sure. What's going on? Is that your speech? No. Um, it's actually a letter written to me from my mom. She wrote it before she died, and Bessie's been saving it ever since. Wow. Yeah. Um, have you opened it yet? I tried, and uh, every time I go to open it, I remember what she was like at the end. You know, so still and um, so much pain and suffering. I just kind of freeze up. But that being said, um, I still have to know, so I was wondering if you would read it for me. I'd be honored. Thank you. My darling Joey, I know if you're reading these words, it means you've graduated from high school. Congratulations, sweetheart. You didn't have a lot growing up. You'll even have been shortchanged one mother. Still, I want you to be proud of your family. If our strife has caused you pain, remember it also makes you strong. Bessie is strong, and I'm sure she's taken good care of you. Of all the things my illness has robbed me of, I count the greatest of them watching you grow up. You're barely 13 now, still a young girl. And so I'm left to imagine the woman you've become. Strikingly beautiful, I'm sure, and equally unaware of it. Quick-witted and strong-willed. Possessing the deep, soulful eyes of an artist, the shy smile regularly betrays the tough facade you do your best to keep up. If any of this sounds remarkably on the nose, it's because it's the girl you always were, Joey. And it's the woman you'll always be. Whatever you decide to do with your life, I know your future will be luminous. Wherever you decide to go when you leave, remember your days in Cape Side fondly. And keep close those who shared your childhood. They will always love you in a way no one else can, and they will always be with you. Just as I love you, and will always be with you. Love, Mom. <laughs>